Hey everybody, this is Ben here, That Cologne Guy. Welcome to the short version of, of this week's review. Um, if, if you stumbled on this one, uh, every week what I do for my uh, reviews is I do a short English review uh, version uh, under four minutes, and then I do a long one, and I just did the long one, and, and oh, 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 how long it is, actually. And uh, in the long one, I have you know editing, I have pictures, I have sounds, I have uh, bonus features, I have intros, I have outros, I have altros. No, uh, and this one is different. The, uh, a lot of my subscribers have said they're very busy, and they just want me to cut to the chase. They don't want any any editing, nothing. So I just do this in one take and I keep it under four minutes. Let's go. This is this is Beloved Man by Amouage. And uh, a very long story short is I reviewed this already in uh, two years ago. And I might even break my little rule of not having anything in the short version. And I might put it, it should be right there. But if it's not, uh, you can check it out. Episode 27. I did two years ago and I had forgotten. So subscriber Ramsey sent me uh, five fragrances, five decants from Amouage. And one of them was uh, a beloved man. And I was out walking when we were going back and forth about which ones to include. And I had forgotten that I had reviewed beloved man already. So then, then when I was reviewing portrayal, man, I accidentally for one day, cause it's got the first letter uh, he wrote on here. I, don't, I think you can see that. See that B? And I thought it was a P. So when I was wearing Patrail Man, the first day I, I accidentally grabbed this one and I and I reviewed it. And I gave myself the the same exact review or rating, which was three out of five, that I did two years ago. So there's a lot of good to come out of that because I feel like, you know what? Um, I'm consistent. Even if you disagree with me, I'm consistent. So uh, I gave it the same rating. And then, of course, I moved over back to the P and started uh, reviewing uh, Portrayal Man uh, for the rest of the week. And I reviewed that. So so then after that, I wore it this week. And this is the epitome of nice. This is the epitome of pleasant. You just have to ask yourself, do I want to pay $330 for nice and pleasant? Um, and the answer might be yes. It is highly, highly, highly versatile. This is the one Amouage release I would choose to give as a gift to anyone. Men, women, 30 and up. I mean, it's just day, night, office, rom romantic night out. This is the most approachable uh, Amouage release. Very, very nice. And I, I could see people being neutral or lukewarm. I can't see anyone disliking this fragrance, just outright disliking. So so kudos to them for doing that. Um, the question that comes up, though, is, you know, is that enough to smell nice? That might be enough for you. And if you've got the money uh, to spend on this, you can get this a discounted for about 200 bucks, and then in retail is 330 if that works for you, then do it because it really, really does smell very nice and pleasant and fantastic. I just, for me, it just doesn't quite make the cut. So what I said in the long version was I gave Portrayal Man and I gave uh, Sunshine Man a three out of five. And this one, I like this one more. But I can't say that I like it at the same level as Lyric Man, uh, which I reviewed and gave that a 4 out of 5. Uh, to me, when it's a 4 or a 5, I seek them out. I really want them. I, I look online uh, for uh, deals. So uh, I never really did this one, obviously, two years ago. S since then, I didn't really look Beloved Man back up, and I think that speaks for itself. So there you have it, folks. 3 out of 5. I'm going to stick to my original rating. Take care.